Hi, I'm Ali Adnan and I have been traveling the world for the last few years talking about Kavali. A few years ago, I met with Farid Ayaz and Abu Muhammad Kawal, and he said that Ali, I want you to take the message of Kawali all over the world because it's gaining popularity, but people don't have the understanding that they need to truly understand and appreciate Kawali. <laughs> There is an association between Islam and Kavali, but there is not really a solid connection. Kavali predates Islam. The second thing that people say about music not being compatible with Islam is patently false. There is a surah in the Quran, the Surah Imran, which lists the five things that are haram, and music is not one of them. All of us could be listening to the same Kavali. I could be thinking of my daughter. You could be thinking about your mother. It really is a song of love. The issue here is that people don't present it right to them. They want to identify with their culture and they want to understand what is behind the music that they find so very attractive. <laughs> Kavali needs to evolve, Kavali needs to grow. But when you sing Garnari Gawari Kahe So Kahe in Homan Jahan, they sing it very purely. That is not Mira Rashke Kamar being remixed with whistles and stops. That's not the way to do it. Yeah.